area in M2M and, and, and SCADA networking, which has gained a lot of uh, interest and activity lately, is the smart grid. And smart grid is where utility companies are upgrading their distribution infrastructure so that the infrastructure is two-way and they can actually query various distribution points in the network. And as you can see, in terms of the distribution points, it goes from um, the substations to uh, distribution to uh, collectors on down into the home. And at every one of these points, in the smart grid, it's a two-way communications device. This obviously creates opportunities for satellite to provide connectivity solutions. Uh, and some of the obvious areas are at the substation where there's um, a relatively higher amount of data requirement, as well as um, in the collectors, uh, which are collecting the smart meter information from the homes. Generally speaking, I think what we're going to see in the homes with the smart meters are going to be terrestrial wireless devices that are meshed together using unlicensed band. These are very low cost devices. So I, I don't think we're going to see a whole lot of satellite devices in the home, but higher up in the network, I think that we'll see some significant opportunities to deploy satellite based communication devices to aid in the development of the smart grid.